This video is about our new app, Makerist AR, which allows you to transfer sewing patterns directly to your fabric without using a printer, scissors, glue, or even paper. AR stands for Augmented Reality. We're going to augment the reality we see through our smartphones. If I open my phone's camera app, I can see what's really there. But when I focus my phone on a piece of fabric that I've prepared, I can augment reality via this app to include a pattern piece in what I see via my camera. It's kind of like those filters you see on social media. You'll still see your hand, your fabric chalk or marker, and your fabric, but we'll superimpose the pattern piece in so you can easily trace it off onto the fabric itself. It might all sound a little futuristic, but it's really simple to use. We're going to look in detail at the Makerist AR app and see how it works, walk you through how to register and access your sewing patterns, and finally, we'll trace out a paperless sewing pattern together. You can download the Makerist AR app in the iOS App Store. The app is currently only available for iPhone, but stay tuned as we're hard at work on the Android version. Once you've downloaded the app, you go through a few slides with helpful tips. Our phone is currently set to German, but the app will also be available in English and French. Here you'll be able to enter your email address to receive a Magic Link login. Please make sure to use the same email address as your Makerist account. Once you're logged in, you can see any patterns you bought previously that are currently available in AR, as well as some free books from Makerist so you can get a better understanding of AR patterns in different contexts. You'll only be able to see your Makerist patterns if you've made sure to use the same email address you use for your Makerist account, so don't forget this step. Here's what the main menu looks like. You can find the main menu with their FAQ and other links at the top of the page. You can also see all of your AR patterns here. We're going to start working with this Makerist free book for a little purse, which should be available to you in the app when you first log in. On the pattern page, you can see a picture of the finished pattern, the sizes available, and a list of all available pattern pieces. This link here leads to a step-by-step -step tutorial for the bag, because we've chosen a pattern which is also available on our blog. Not all patterns have a tutorial link, but some may, and you're always able to download and read the PDF tutorial that comes with your Makerist pattern on our website. A designer might also use this area to upload a layout plan to help you figure out the best way to position your pattern pieces for cutting. Moving on to sizes. The example we're looking at here is a single size pattern, but we'll take a quick look later at an example with more than one size. If we tap on piece A, it will activate the camera function and prompt you to place the camera over the anchor. If you haven't printed out your anchor yet, a link to download the anchor file is also available on this screen. Let's look at the anchor in more detail. If you click here, you can download our PDF and print out your own copy of the anchor. It's important to follow the printing instructions on the PDF and re-measure the anchor after it's been printed to make sure it's exactly the size stated. The anchor literally anchors the pattern pieces to reality and ensures that patterns are generated in the correct size. So we recommend printing it on a thicker paper or pasting your anchor to a piece of cardboard cut to size to help preserve it. Now that you've got your anchor ready, let's see how patterns work within Makerist AR. I have my phone on a tripod for this demonstration, but normally you'd hold your phone in one hand and use the other to mark out the pattern pieces. We recommend holding your phone about 30 centimeters or 11 inches away from the fabric. Once the anchor is in view of the camera, the magic happens. You can see the lines of the pattern piece around the anchor here. You can find the settings in the menu at the bottom right, which you can use to change out the color of the pattern pieces so you have the best contrast against your fabric, change pattern pieces, read construction notes and tips from the designer under the gray eye, or adjust the position of the pattern piece in relation to the anchor using these arrows. You can move the piece up and down as well as left and right. As long as the anchor remains visible to the camera, you can generate a pattern piece in a position that's convenient for your project. Let's start transferring. I'm looking at my phone and drawing dots onto my fabric directly under the lines that I can see on my smartphone.
For straight lines, you don't have to transfer very much, just two points that you'll connect later with a ruler. For rounded sections, I'm tracing off more of the shape to be sure that I'm transferring the piece correctly. Now you can see the shape of the transferred pattern. I still need to use a ruler to add in the straight line sections, but we've successfully transferred our first pattern piece. To recap, make sure you keep your phone around 30 centimeters or 11 inches away from your fabric. Make sure your fabric is lying flat on your workspace and won't shift around. We highly recommend ironing your fabric before use to ensure best results. We recommend using a fabric marker or some other non-permanent method to mark out your pattern pieces. And it's important to make sure that the anchor is always fully visible to the camera. We've gone handheld to work with a more complex pattern piece now. I can swipe through the different sizes to find the one I want and view the individual pattern pieces here. You can download the pattern piece by piece or all at once. Let's look at the sleeve pattern piece. I'm turning the AR generated lines blue so there's more contrast against my fabric. Hovering above the fabric, I can easily see the complete pattern piece within my camera screen. You can also see that the anchor is crossing over the pattern in a couple of places. So I'm going to adjust the position using the arrows. The little yellow box in the bottom is telling me that the anchor isn't visible anymore, so I need to adjust my pattern in relation to the anchor and start again. You can use your phone in portrait or landscape mode to fit the entire pattern piece on your screen. It's so easy to transfer patterns with Makerist AR. Once you've got your anchor, you'll never need to print out another PDF ever again. Projects have never been faster now that you don't have to spend ages fussing with printing, assembling, cutting and gluing paper patterns together. Plus, you'll never have to worry about misplacing a pattern piece ever again. Makerist AR is simple to use and just gets easier the more you adapt to the augmented reality setup. You can browse the selection of free books already included in the app, or check out some AR patterns created by our talented designers on Makerist.com. Please keep in mind that Makerist AR is a work in progress. We're hard at work improving the app and the technologies behind it to make the process even smoother, as well as making it possible for you to transfer larger and more complicated patterns in the future. Head over to the App Store to download the app, and please let us know your thoughts via our feedback survey. Feedback is crucial to ensuring that Makerist AR develops into the best version possible. You can also send us an email via our customer support portal, or contact us via our social media channels. We're really excited to hear from you, and we hope you enjoy using Makerist AR in your everyday sewing life. Happy sewing!